Good morning. Um, I'm very glad that Peter uh, was ahead of me because actually what I'm going to be talking about is dealing with the issues that Peter raised. So for those who don't know Orchidata, we provide online solutions for uh, large property owners. And they inherit buildings and data from you know, other uh, portfolios. So our core business is to organize, standardize, and leverage the data our clients have on hand, which sometimes is like you know, paper or scan paper. So we take, hold on, we take whatever data they have and drawings, and then we organize it into this, something easy, visual, and updated. So once we've organized all the data and the drawings in the plan room, then we're able to give our client a snapshot of their building, which is this, the building dashboard. So it's a single window uh, access. They have, um, they have everything there. From the CAD drawings, we're able to generate the stacking plans, the BOMO reports, the EGA, CGA for carbon footprint. So actually, we're leveraging as much as we can so the client can save money, <laughs> which is really neat. So then, you know, it's nice to have innovative solutions, but we also need processes. So what we do, we take the CAD drawings and we convert the 2D data to 3D, which is an IFC. And um, from the IFC data, we can use Solibri as a viewer to see the building. And our clients like um, Great West Life, Cadillac Fairview, uh, they use the BIM model to manage um, equipment, you know, the, um, <clears throat> when they have to change assets. A, a big, um, a popular application is Windows. Windows, even from day one, break. So you have to te keep track of when they were installed and what model you have to use. So I'll, I'll show you examples later. But then, once we have the BIM model, we have to update it. And that's where the plan room comes in because we have this process with our clients that after each, each retrofit or each um, tenant improvement or expansion, we gather the drawings, we upload them in the system, and then we regenerate the um, IFC file. And from there, we can send the information to other systems like preventive maintenance, asset management, and uh, lease management. But this is all nice for the property manager. We deal with, and there's supposed to be a video, but we also deal with real estate executives. And they won't use the Solibri model and you know they want something quick, nice, uh, pretty picture. So what we do, we convert the IFC to Collada, and the dashboard. Well, basically, we put the information that the client wants to see. It could be um, lease expiry, occupancy, uh, sales per square foot, cost per square foot, revenue per square foot. Wh whatever the client wants to see, it's there. But bottom line, you have to keep the data up to date. And that's, that's, uh, that's where we come in, and that's a process that's very, very important. And here's an, a last um, example. This is our 3D, our BIM um, of the space, but we linked it to uh, VFA, which is a capital planning solution. So we also import data from other systems. And um, we also import data. It could be live. It could be you know, with web ser service. We can schedule an update every minute, every five minutes, every hour, or every week. So thank you very much. <laughs>